Fuel Rules here, and welcome back to Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. Um, first off, I want to apologize for not having uploaded um, in four days. Um, things got hectic in real life, and um, I was unable to record for those amount of days. So because of that, you'll get four videos today, starting with this one. So, whirlwind warning. If you have faith in your spin, step into the wind. How poetic. But basically... What that hint is saying is that we want to use um, Mario's spin ability. Oh, right, forgot. Um, when you're in the uh, spin formation, you can't uh, actually walk forward. So, so we get spun and we just go to the right. It just makes it so we can get over the gap over here. There's nothing interesting down there. I already checked. Just a bunch of enemies. Um, okay, so we have a fire thing here. What does this say? Hoo Hoo Mountain Watering Hole. Yeah, you see, I fell down the mountain. Great. Anyway, we need to put that fire out uh, for some reason. But as you can see, the hands that would normally be spouting the water is not working. So you have to go figure out why that's a thing. Okay, so we have to use... Um, Luigi's high jump to get up here. Oh, syrup. Yeah, syrup re restores your battle points if I haven't mentioned that. And, um, can we even go this way? I actually don't know. What's this? Uh, beware of overhydrate. Yeah, it's the same exact thing as before. Last time we did this, stomp on the person's head if they're suffering from from dehydration. As I explained with the other podium, you walk over here, step on Mario's head, he puts it out, and it becomes extraordinarily lifeless, which is creepy. Yep, and it creates a uh, whirlwind for us. Nice. So now we can get across this uh, gap. Yeah, you don't actually have to sit in the uh, whirlwind to let it build up or anything like that. I just like doing it. Um, so let's go ahead and save and continue. Probably means that there's going to be a boss battle of some kind coming up, seeing as we have a save point um, in a really random feeling location right now. Okay. Um, I do want to see what's in this block over here. Just a mushroom. I don't think we can jump up. Yeah. Okay, we can do it from there. Nice. Yeah, make sure that the things are set to regular jump when you do this, or it won't work. As I demonstrated in a previous video, I think I messed up when I was doing one of those. I keep forgetting which, which button I have set for B and which ones I have set for A. And I don't don't need to do that anymore. Okay, so we have more enemies in this area. I'll clear them out if there are new enemies. I'll show them off, so I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. Just a couple of dry bones and beanies. Um, before we continue, though, um, I do want to use a mushroom on Luigi. And how much does this recover? 20? Um, hmm, I might as well. I'll use a syrup on both of them. And we have another one of these uh, fire totem things. Yeah, you don't have to be standing directly in the middle of it for her to register just as long as it's being spat on it. Spin across. Nice. Yeah, and, um, okay, so we have another one here, which means there's probably a, um, another spout down there. But, um, I also see that there are a few, probably a few enemies down there as well. Ah. Uh, <laughs> okay, so I earned a level from that battle for Mario. And um, I think we're going to go on ahead and 
increase his defense, because I took quite a bit of damage in that last battle. Not enough to, like, you know, be overly concerned or anything. And we have another Dry Bones here. There we go. Okay, in that battle I earned a level for Luigi. Nice. And... Hmm. I'm gonna increase his uh, battle points. They seem a little bit low to me. Okay, plus two. Okay, we have another one of these strange X's on the ground. But, um... Hmm. So, we need to bring water over here. Do we have to do it from the other screen? We do. Okay. And that was the reason why I cleared out all the enemies on this screen, so that when I'm doing this, um, I don't get into an encounter. Okay, so the whirlwind has been activated, so let's go back over and we need to use the uh, other whirlwind that we used to get over there in the first place. For a second there, I thought I was going to miss the whirlwind. Ooh, what's this do? Oh, it activates that. Nice. Okay, so that's now accessible to us. And, um... I don't know how I get over there, actually. Yeah, I don't know. I'm just gonna leave that dry bones because I don't want to fight every single enemy that I see. Yeah, I did see. I did leave some enemies alive, the ones I didn't have to fight that wouldn't be in my way. Because I remember when I played this game when I had it for the uh, GBA, I was very overpowered for a lot of it. And it kind of made the game feel a little bit boring when I could. Uh, Almost one shot everything. Okay. And just a couple of dry bones down there. I guess in case you fail, you get punished somehow. Though so I do want to see if there's anything up here. Oh, there is. Good thing I checked. A one up mushroom. Ooh, and a coin box. Nice. Okay. Ooh, another save point. Huhuro's Gate. So I just want to uh, check my health and stuff real quick. Mm. I have enough mushrooms. Give one to Mario. And... I have enough battle points. It's fine. Okay, so, um... So yeah, we have an incoming, uh, boss battle here. Ah! Travelers, I'm Huros, the ancient weapon of the Huro civilization. Beyond this point, the path grows even crueler. You must prove yourselves up to the challenge. Dare you to try this challenge? Yes. You must start now, and you must catch 10 hoo hoo spirits within 30 seconds. Do not fall off the ledges, or you will immediately fail. Yeah, I hope you mastered the spin technique for this. Three. Come on. I remember this was very challenging when I did this the first time. I mean, when I actually played the game on GPA, not when I was doing this. I'm actually doing a lot better. I remember this took me like five or six attempts just because I kept falling off the ledges and stuff like that. Now, for your next challenge, you must defeat me! Yep, remember how I said there was a boss battle here? Yep. Let us begin. Okay. So... He is in this pillar, so I think we want to attack the pillar he's under. Yeah. I think? 
Oh, no, 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 no. I remember how this works. Um, what you want to do is the pillar that he's not under. You want to destroy that. And then destroy the one he's under. Because then he has nowhere to run and hide. Yeah, and I think he... I don't think he has a physical attack. I think he only attacks with the laser beams. Actually, back for a second. Because I want to use Bro's attack. I want to use these as much as possible. I have gotten myself up to level 2 of doing it. Because it's a lot easier to do without the... Um, the slow-mo. I say as I uh, completely mess up the uh, combo, actually. But anyway... Nice, got that one. Yeah, so now the pillars are back. And the other one... Sh oh, actually, no, they're both just attack Mario. Okay, that's fine. That's the one he went under, so I want to attack this one. And then attack this one. Yeah, it's not a very hard boss fight. His attacks are pretty basic, easy to dodge. Let's go ahead and use this again. And not mess it up this time. There we go, nice. So, um, I'll use one more Splash Bros attack on him. Okay. So he went under that one, so I want to destroy this, and then destroy that. So I'm not going to use the uh, combos anymore, because I'm running low on battle points. Um, actually, I'm going to have Luigi attack the pillar that he would normally go to hide under. But yeah, basically it's the same exact thing. He goes underneath the pillar, the pillar zaps you, and if he's exposed, he does a sweeping laser thing. Okay, there we go. I was a little bit nervous about that one. Mainly because it's a little bit hard to gauge it when uh, he starts on Luigi's side. There we go. Also, I think if you get hit by the laser, um, it causes the person to trip and fall down, or it can possibly do that. And then it leaves them completely vulnerable to the next attack. I'm not going to test that. I'm just going to trust that that's what happened. I don't exactly remember. Okay, I might use one more combo on him. This is taking a little bit too long for my liking. I'll use one more uh, Splash Bros attack on him. Oh, got him! Nice! You have passed this test too. Now you must face the test of reaching the summit. Okay. But we'll do that in the uh, next video. Um, if you enjoyed this video, give it a like. Also be sure to like my Facebook page and follow me on Twitter as well as support me on Patreon. All three links will be in the description below and subscribe for more. And if you are subscribed or a new subscriber right now, be sure to hit that bell icon so you get notified of when I upload videos. This is Viola Rules, signing off. Talk to you later.